Today's Cobb highlight is all about the FA20 WRX top mount intercooler and its accompanying charge pipe kit. After your introductory mods like an access port, an intake, or an exhaust, for a lot of applications, an improved intercooler is usually the next big step, and that's certainly the case in the 2015 plus generation of WRXs. The stock intercooler isn't terrible for stock power, but these WRXs respond really well to tuning, and the stock core quickly becomes a limitation, especially in the summer months. Switching to a nice big front mounted intercooler is always a good option, and we've had a nice version of that available for a while, but we're really excited about this custom top mounted design. Let's start with the most important part, the core itself. It's 15.75 by 9.65 by 3.94 inches, which currently makes it the largest core in the market. It's a bar and plate Garrett core with our own custom cast aluminum intakes that provides a 31% increase in airflow over stock, and it's offered in silver or black. With any aftermarket bar and plate intercooler, it's gonna weigh a bit more, but the trade-off is more than worth it. And with that in mind, we include this really nice mounting bracket, plus a bushing to support this thick boy, and make sure to cut down on any vibrations or sound that might come from the engine. Next is this thing, AKA the thrust tunnel. What good's a big fat intercooler upgrade if you can't thrust a bunch of fresh air through it, right? So this aluminum piece attaches under the hood and works to efficiently channel as much external air as possible from the hood scoop directly to the core. And we provide a strip of trim lock to go around it to make sure that it gets a nice seal. Also, with the black wrinkled powder coating and the cob logo, it adds some style when you have the hood popped. And as usual, the devil's in the details. So this kit includes very high quality fittings, hardware, and clamps like these black button head cap screws that mount to the thrust tunnel so they blend in for a clean look, and our multi-layer reinforced silicone couplers are more than up to the task of handling some extra pressure when you turn up the boost. All of which leads to the ultimate question, why should I consider a top mount versus a front mount? To be honest, the easy answer is price. For roughly half the cost of any quality aftermarket front mount, you can still get huge performance, reliability, and efficiency gains over stock, but there's other benefits as well. The installation is a lot easier and more simple, which doesn't just save you time and headaches, it also reduces the number of spots where you can develop boost leaks or even completely blow off a coupler when driving hard. Anyone who's installed a front mount kit knows that it can be a bit of a pain to get everything lined up perfectly and how annoying it is when something comes loose. So for a lot of people, a good top mount is all that you'll ever really need, and the stock style fitment keeps the car looking sleepy while also being really easy to work on. A key part of upgrading your top mount intercooler is the charge pipe that actually connects the bigger, better core to the turbo. The Cobb charge pipe is required for our top mount intercooler, but it's also compatible with the stock intercooler, which is why we provide this extra silicone coupler for that purpose. Plastic charge pipes always suck. They do their job at first, but they're restrictive and like pretty much all OEM plastic parts, the older they get, the more prone they are to fail. That becomes an even more prevalent issue for parts that are under pressure, especially when tuning to raise that pressure even more. So the mere fact that the Cobb charge pipe is made from aluminum and uses high quality multi-layer reinforced silicone couplers with strong clamps means that this upgrade is a no-brainer at any point in the modification journey. But those aren't the only benefits. The charge pipe starts at a larger two and a half inch diameter from the intercooler core to make the most of the increased flow while gradually tapering down to two inches around the middle section. The thing that you can't tell easily due to the wrinkled black powder coating is that this tapered part is an actual billet aluminum piece. So that produces a really consistent and smooth transition between the different diameter pipes to make sure it provides the most flow possible yet still has enough clearance for the larger aftermarket radiators and fits properly with the turbo inlet diameter while still being able to handle plenty of power. Plus the kit includes this silicone piece that connects to this turbo two bolt flange which allows it to work with stock or aftermarket bypass valves. And the entire thing is compatible with our off the shelf maps to boot. Honestly, this charge pipe kit is something that every single FA20 WRX owner should get for their car if they're not using a front mount intercooler. And you can do that on CobTuning.com right now.